The Home Affairs Minister, Arun Muzwaledi, says while his department is addressing porous borders, the responsibility also lies with South Africans to ensure that their country is not invaded by illegal immigrants. He says some communities have a tendency of not reporting people who are undocumented. Muzwaledi. Anyone who knowingly employs an illegal foreigner or a foreigner in violation of this act shall be guilty of an offence and liable on conviction to a fine or imprisonment not exceeding one year.
Anyone who knowingly employs an illegal foreigner or a foreigner in violation of this act shall be guilty of an offence and liable on conviction to a fine or imprisonment not exceeding one year, provided that such person's second conviction of such an offence shall be punishable by imprisonment not exceeding two years or a fine, and the third and subsequent convictions of such an offence by imprisonment not exceeding five years without the option of a fine. The Home Affairs Minister, Arun Muzwaledi, says while his department is addressing porous borders, the responsibility also lies with South Africans to ensure that their country is not invaded by illegal immigrants. He says some communities have a tendency of not reporting people who are undocumented. Muzwaledi also called on municipalities to implement strict bylaws for businesses that could be operated by unregistered owners who are not contributing as taxpayers. ENC's Ronald Masinda reports from Kabekh. Home Affairs Minister Aaron Mutsualedi says he's prepared to fight tooth and nail to get rid of corruption within his department. He says those who are undermining the work done by government by being involved in illegal acts must face the full might of the law. There's a gentleman here who was called a prophet. And South Africa still believes he's a prophet. A gentle, yes, a gentleman by the name of Bushiri. Yes. He came here we gave him a, a visa to come and visit because we don't chase visitors away. He arrived here on a visit. He then corrupted Home Affairs officials and they gave him a permanent residence document. Mutsoledi was addressing community members from various parts of Kabecha who say that they've been grappling with illegal immigrants in their communities. Anywhere in South Africa where there's a city center, the CBD is currently controlled by foreign nationals. And that is a big concern. For me personally, that is a huge concern because it degrades. And, and, and I'm not saying that um, they, the activities that is accompanying that, that residency degrades our human values, it degrades our moral fiber.